Hello, Maya. Hello, Miguel. Mama, Poppy, it's Greg and Isoka. Hello, good evening. Hi, Greg. Hi, Isoka. Hello. Oh, please, come on in. How are you? I hope we're not interrupting dinner. Of course not. No, please sit down. Well, I was just making puff puffs, and I know that they're your favorite snack. As usual, Isoka made way more than the two of us could ever eat. <gasps> Did you make the kind with the powdered sugar on top? Of course. <laughs> Thanks, Isoka. Mm, puff puffs. Oh, no, not for you, Paco. And you, I thought you couldn't eat another bite. Please, Papi, I can't be rude to Isoka. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Isoka. Oh, yes, thanks. Lucky for you, we don't have kids of our own, or else we wouldn't have all these extra puff puffs around. <laughs> hmm. That's true. Hmm. Well, we should be going. We'll see you later. Adios. Hey, thanks again. What a treat. Goodbye. Bye. Thanks for the puff puffs. Mama? Poppy? What is it, Maya? Greg and Isoka don't have any children. Pero mi reina, some families have children and some don't. But don't you feel bad for them? I mean, you always say that having kids was the best thing that ever happened to you. Claro que sí. You're the light of our lives. You kids make every day a joy. Most of the time. But Greg and Isoka will never know what it's like. Like when you take your kids to the park, or when they paint a rainbow and bring it home from school. Or on Mother's Day, when they make you breakfast in bed. I remember the first time you made me a card. We still have glue in the carpet. Well, doesn't Isoka deserve a card, too? Greg and Isoka seem very happy the way they are. Translation, don't start getting any of your big ideas. I was just feeling bad for them. No te preocupes, Maya. They seem to be just fine without your help. Bueno, mamá. Miguel! Miguel, despierta! Uh, no es good today, mamá. It's Groundhog Day. It's not, mamá. It's me, Maya, your favorite sister. Mm. Alrighty, your only sister. Wake up! Maya? ¿Qué pasa? Estoy pensando. Oh, no. It's about Greg and Isoka. Okay, I'm sorry I ate your puff puff. No! Miguel, we need to show them how much fun kids like us are. With only two adults in the house, how could they have any fun? Adults know how to have fun. Listen. <laughs> Come on, Miguel. How boring would it be to have to dance with the same person all the time? Imagine if it were only the two of us. Huh. When you put it that way. What's going to happen to them later? When they're old. Like when they turn 30. They won't have anyone to play games with them and do the things older people need their kids to do. Maya, ¿estás confundida? I think you're confusing old people with dogs. You know what I mean. I just wish there was something we could do. There's something you could do for me, Maya. What's that? Go to sleep? <sighs> okay, Miguelito. When is not just... Maya, Maya, Maya! I just can't help feeling bad for them. Please, just leave them alone, Maya. All right, leave them alone. Leave them alone. Santiago, ¿qué vamos a hacer? This Saturday is that dinner to honor Mama, and we're invited. Fantastico, let's go. I hope they have good food. <laughs> but who will watch Maya and Miguel? Teresa and Ernesto are away, and, and the evening goes very late. What is it, Maya? It's a bad idea, Mama. Really? You haven't even heard it, Miguel. It doesn't matter. I can tell. Mama, Poppy, why don't we stay with Greg and Isoka? They're practically family. Hey, that actually sounds like fun. Mm. 
I don't think we should impose. Please, 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 please. Eh, pretty please. We'd love to. Oh, we'd love to. <laughs> it would be a pleasure. In fact, we don't spend enough time with Maya and Miguel. I told you they needed us. Hey, why don't we spend the whole day together? You can pick us up in the morning, and we can go out for breakfast, and then to the arcade, and... Maya, Greg and Isoka are being very generous already. Sounds like a great idea. In fact, let's make it a sleepover. It'll be fun. Whoa, whoa, wait a second. You want to take Maya and Miguel for the whole night? That's right. No hay problema. <laughs> That's uh, wonderful. <laughs> Yay! Great. We'll pick them up Saturday morning. See you then. Bye-bye. Goodbye now. I can't wait. Greg and Isoka are going to have a blast. Ow! Tienen sus suetes. Sí, mamá. Have a good time. If you need anything, I have my phone. Don't worry. We'll take good care of them. What about me? We can't forget Paco. The more the merrier. Happy! See, you're going to love having kids around. Yeah, I can't wait to show you all the rides at Majestic Mountain. I'm so excited! Are you sure we're ready for this? How hard can it be to look after two kids for 24 hours? I can't believe you've never been here for breakfast. Yeah, it's great. And it's the kind of place you'll come to all the time with your own kids. You know, I'm supposed to keep to a strict diet. I have a bit of a sensitive stomach sometimes. Oh, it's Saturday, Greg. You can go crazy once in a while. That's the way it is with kids. Well, I suppose you're right. And I was eyeing the fat stuck blueberry bark. the whole thing, you get another one for free. Wow, that's so cool. Oh. <laughs> you have to finish it. Yeah, blueberry bard, blueberry bard. Yum. Well, I don't know about that. Oh, you have to, Greg. Then you get to come back next week and get a free one. You can do it. <laughs> You know, for a while there, I wasn't sure if I ate it or it ate me. <laughs> <laughs> They're having a great time. Yeah, but wait until we get to Majestic ah. Mountain. Then they'll really have fun. We have to go on every ride. Yeah, especially the behemoth roller coaster. <laughs> If you had your own kids, you'd be doing this stuff all the time. Or you could just take us. Favorito. Mm, favorite lunch! Favorite lunch! Greg, do you want to try my cheese and chili french fries? Oh, thank you, but I'm going to skip lunch. You know, Miguel, I'm not really big on roller coasters. I get a little dizzy sometimes. 
and I'm still a little full from that big breakfast. Come on, Greg, it's so much fun, you'll love it. Don't worry, you're gonna have a great time. Is that thing stuck again? Oh, that's been happening a lot. Sorry, sir, you're just gonna have to take the ride again till we can get somebody down here for maintenance. Again? Oh, no. Breakfast. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Ahora va bien. Yeah, they're having a great time. After today, they're definitely going to wish they had their own kids. Well, that was certainly fun. I guess it's time to head home and get some rest. Oh, but it's still early. Yeah, and besides, we haven't had dinner yet. Yeah, I'll help you shop and cook and... Um, we're a little tired. Why don't we eat out? Hey, great idea! I know a really fun restaurant for dinner that's not too expensive. It's a good place to take kids. Well, a nice quiet dinner out might be relaxing. Yes, it might. Quiet and relaxing. Isn't this place the greatest? <laughs> it's really fun. I can't believe you've never seen a ball pit. You can jump in if you want. It's really fun. Oh, no, that's okay. Ah, you kids go ahead if you want. Help! Help me, please! Help! <laughs> Don't worry, Soka. They can't hurt you. Don't worry, dear. I'll save you. Look how much fun they're having. Uh, should we help them? I think we better. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you very much. should be able to sleep well after the big day we had. <laughs> we always sleep well. Somehow that does not surprise me. So, did you have a fun time today? I mean, being with us? Oh, of course. It was quite an experience. Do you think Greg had a good time? I sure did. But I think now it's time for you to get some sleep. Okay. Good night. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Uh, good night. Good night, Paco. Well, I think we did it, Miguel. We showed them how great it is to have kids around. For sure. And I got to uh, show Greg how much fun it is at Majestic Mountain. Are you thirsty? No, just sleepy. I'm going to get a drink of water. Okay. Maya and Miguel are both adorable and terrific kids. But I have to admit, I'm a little worn out. Ah, can you adjust that cold pack? Whew, I get to have it when you're done. Thank you, sweetheart. What a day! Having kids around is exhausting. Miguel, despierta! What? 
Why are you always waking me up? I heard Greg and Isoka talking when I was getting a drink of water. I'm not completely sure they had a really great time today. They did it? They sounded like they were kind of tired. Hmm, that's funny. I'm kind of tired too. No Maya, no Maya. Hmm, I think tomorrow we should show them how helpful kids can be. Or we could just forget about it and go to sleep. <gasps> and I know exactly how we'll do it. Uh-oh, no, Maya. Miguel, cuidado! I'm being careful, Maya. Just don't mess anything up in here. Don't worry. Relax. Okay, this is going to be a perfect breakfast. Mmm, desayuno. Surprise! Surprise! Good morning. We made you a very special, relaxing breakfast. You made this for us? You got it. <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. Really delicious. We just wanted to show you that kids can be very helpful. We can do all kinds of things like make breakfast and do chores around the house and just everything. Oh, well, that's uh, very, very um, good to know. We'll be right back with more orange juice. Don't you worry about cleaning up. I'll do it. After all, I, I know where everything is. Or where it used to be. Okay, if you're sure. We just want to be helpful. Why don't you go see if you can help Greg? Mm, okay. okay. But later today, right before we go, we're going to make you lunch. Is your chair sticking, Greg? Well, I don't know, but it doesn't seem to be going back. Oh, we can fix that. You know, kids can be very helpful when grown-ups want to relax and take it easy. Oh, well, if you think you can fix it. No problem. Don't worry about a thing. Miguel can fix almost anything. All I have to do is twist this knob and your chair will move back nice and easy. That's nice, Maya. But I've been giving myself the same beauty treatment for ten years. But I could give you a much better beauty treatment. It's the one Mama and my aunt use. It's guaranteed to make you look ten years younger, and it uses all natural products. All natural products? Yes, mostly vegetables and fruits and things. And after my tia, my aunt, started using it, everyone said she never looked more beautiful. Well, maybe it's worth a try. Just leave everything to me. Hmm, this feels nice. Are you ready? I can't wait. Prepare to see the most beautiful woman in the world. <gasps> what happened? You know, um, that didn't quite turn out like I thought. I look oh. horrible. Yeah, I had to substitute a few things. Substitute? Like instead of cucumbers for your eyes, I use beets. Will, will, will this come off? Eventually. So how'd it go? Oh, I look hideous. It could have been better. Oh. Well, at least the good news is it's almost time to go home. Yeah, I guess my plan didn't work. Don't worry, Maya. At least we tried. Come on, guys. Your parents are expecting you home. Okay. I just need to do one thing. So, did you have fun this weekend? Mm, 
Sí, pero... But what? ¿Qué pasa, hija? Well, I guess we've learned something about having kids. It's not easy. Still, it was sort of fun, don't you think? Yeah. And my skin actually does feel pretty soft. Whew. Hey, what's this? It's just too bad because Greg and Isoka took such good care of us. Yeah, they did everything we wanted. And they never got mad, even when we kept messing up. And we should have seen that they're happy just the way they are. <sighs> Come on in. How are you? Hi, Greg. Uh, don't worry. Whatever it was, we will pay you for it. It's okay. We just wanted to say thank you for the lovely card. If Greg and I ever have children, I hope they're just like you two. So that was our 24 hours with Greg and Isoka. They had so much fun that Miguel and I decided to plan a big surprise for their wedding anniversary. Oh, I bet they love it!